Hello, my name is Slade Sadoff, and my faith statement verse is John 3, 16 through 17. For God so loved the world that he sent his only Son, that whoever believes in him should not perish, but have eternal life. For God did not send his Son into the world to condemn the world, but in order that the world might be saved through him. This is used just after Jesus' birth in the book of John, saying what Jesus has come to do here and why. I believe that this verse represents the truth that God is merciful and loving. This shows this because the text states that God so loved the world that he gave his one and only son to save it. This shows that he is merciful because the world is not perfect and definitely has its faults. It also shows that God is powerful and has power over death and life. The text states that his son would be able to save the world and allow them to enter eternal life. God is also shown to care for everyone, not just his people. He wants to save us all. I also believe that another truth is sown, that God did not send his son into the world to condemn the Romans like the Israelites and Pharisees thought back in the day or anybody else, but instead he came to save everyone. This truth is also shown through Jesus' walk of life and ministry in his time on, on this earth. But another truth is shown about Jesus in this verse, and that truth is that he has saved me from perishing through faith and a true, strong, and valuable relationship with him. He also lived a life of miracles and hardship, only be, be betrayed by many of his closest followers on the last night of his life as he went through excruciating pain before the cross and on it. All of this he has done for me, and I believe this to be true. He suffered so that I could be saved and rose again so that I can one day rise again in heaven. Now on to what that means for my life in the future. I believe that this verse gives me hope in my future. It gives me purpose and a hope in life in my darkest of times. The type of hope is the fact that I now know that I am saved and that I can go to heaven and live eternally with him. This verse also shows the true meaning and baptism and confirmation for me. And that meaning is to be born again, either by being born again into the family of God or into my new family of the church. Both, both I see it as a new beginning. And finally, this verse gives me hope that my relatives who died are up in heaven celebrating and praising God. Thank you for listening to my faith statement.